Hello, my name is Cheryl Belkin Epstein, and I teach the history of ballet here at Canada's National Ballet School. We're training for a professional career in ballet begins at age 11, with daily ballet classes held separately for girls and boys. In these classes, all the students will be introduced to the fundamentals of ballet. But for the girls, there is an additional challenge. Early in their first year, they will be fitted for point shoes and begin the long road to mastering point work, the defining characteristic of the ballerina. Eventually, the young female dancer must become as competent and as confident in her point shoes as she is in her soft slippers. In the boys' classes, special attention is paid to developing good form in turns and jumps so that they can begin to develop the power that they will need for the multiple turns and explosive jumps that are associated with the mature male dancer. They will also need to develop the upper body strength that will enable them to support and lift the girls once partnering begins. The introduction to partnering takes place in character dance classes where the young dancers learn about spatial awareness and how to relate to a partner. Later, they will move on to supported adagio classes, where the girls will continue to refine their balance on point, the boys will learn how to be sensitive and responsive to the girls' needs in that regard, and they will begin assisted jumps as a first step in learning how to work together for the larger lifts to come. Finally, the senior students will move on to full pas de deux classes, where they will continue to develop their partnering skills. At Canada's National Ballet School, the ultimate goal of training, however, is to create expressive dancers capable of moving an audience. And so throughout their years of training, special attention is paid in every class to nurturing their musical and artistic sensibilities.